for another year of Desert Smash out in the La Quinta area. Wonderful event. Of course, Gavin Rossdale's here, Murphy Jensen, they always come to support this fabulous event every year. But this year we spoke to some new people like Svetlana Kuznetsova, and she had some really interesting things to say about young American tennis players. Listen to this. Is it true that we're, we're lazy? Yeah. <laughs> She's not going to mince words. I'm honest as always I am because in, in Russia we don't have any sponsorship deals, any uh, rich parents. It's very unusual if you do have some, you know, because people, the kids are hungry and if they get any chance they start to fight for any chance, you know, and their life is extremely hard and that's why they make so many good uh, players because they're hungry for winning, hungry for living better with the live. All right, well, welcome everybody. Uh, another great turnout. We've got uh, great pros, some of the best in the world. We got some of the best celebrities in the world who also fancy themselves tennis players. So we're going to find out what they're made of. Svetlana, we saw you out there rocking the cool sunglasses. You decided to put them up now. How are you playing today? Yeah, it's great. It's great atmosphere here. Playing with people, having fun, is great. We noticed you taking it very easy on your opponents. Playing very yeah, nicely. So of course, you know, we gotta make a game. We're not hitting hard, we're not animals, we're just having fun. Hi, I'm Paulina Sussman, and I'm here at the seventh annual Desert Smash event at the La Quinta Resort. I'm here with Gavin Rosdale, tennis pro and also very well known singer. So Gavin, is this time your first time playing in the event? No, I've done it a few years and uh, I know Ryan from way back when it first began here so I just um, love coming every year. It's a good excuse to get out of LA and I try and get all my work done just before so I can just really relax and have fun out here. Yeah, it's really, it's a great relaxing atmosphere. Hey there, I'm playing here with Andrew, one of the top juniors in the United States of America, the future of American tennis. Andrew, what happened in your match today? <laughs> oh boy, Murphy just overpowered me. It's I difficult. overpowered, yeah, very, very difficult, yeah, right? Yeah, Well, anyway, where do you plan on going from here? You know, what are your big plans? Um, you know, I'd like to be able to train hard and work hard and be a professional someday. Well, that's not how you make it. It's yeah. like, stay up late. We've been all exactly. day. Party. Just party. That's <laughs> yep. how you make it. Well, Andrew, thanks a yeah, lot. Th thank you for Enjoy everything. the tennis today. The future it. of American thank tennis. You. Thank you. It's a big partier. Hi, this is Lauren Marker at the K Swiss Desert Smash, and I'm here with Dinara Safina. Dinara, how many times have you played the BNP, and how do you like Palm Springs? Oh, I think it's my. since 2003. I haven't played last year because I've been injured, so I'm back. So I'm really happy to be back here. Are you finding that uh, some of these people are pretty good, give you a good match? Yeah, they do. You know, they're trying hard and some of them, they're really going for the shot. So you have to be ready for a volley. Now, who's the pro out here that you're looking forward to playing against? Against my coach. <laughs> I'm with the director of tennis, Tom Gorman. How are you doing, Tom? I'm doing great. This is such a pretty day out. Um, are you so excited for your event today? Well, we're thrilled to host the seventh annual K-Swiss Desert Smash. It's such a great charity event for the local kids' charities here in the Desert Variety Club. So we're thrilled. We have a beautiful day, as always, here in, so in La Quinta. After a great day of tennis and watching all the kids play against the pros and watching the celebrities play against the pros, this is their dessert. This is their fun time. This is where they get to come out and have a few drinks and have something to eat and maybe raise some money for the variety club of the desert. While I go look around, see what kind of food they have, you check out what kind of gifts they're auctioning off.
as far as singing goes, you have any new songs coming out? I have a new Bush record coming out in the summer. So I just finished oh. recording, I'm in the middle of finishing recording here. Try and finish. Okay, well, I'm excited for that. We're here with Alicia Witt. Alicia, did you see some good tennis today? The tennis was awesome. I actually saw Djokovic play at the US Open in the semifinals a few years back. So it was really fun to get to see him up close, playing with Fernando and watching them with the mics on, bantering back and forth. Yeah, they're, they're easy on the eyes. We're here with Anand. Were you playing today? Yes. How'd you do? Quite well, actually won a few matches, lost a few, and played on courts three and four all afternoon, so it was a lot of fun. And uh, got to meet a lot of very nice people. So it was, uh, all in all, it was a very good cause. Do you get to play with uh, Murphy Jensen at all? Not today. Not today? But I have played with him and with the Bryan brothers at their event in Malibu, at the Malibu Racquet Club. Well, everybody knows who this handsome devil is, but not everybody gets to talk to him. I do. You were so good out there. It's so good for you to be here and support this wonderful cause. Thank you. Thank you for the kind words. It is a wonderful cause. Um, this is my uh, third time here. Uh, Variety is awesome. Uh, you know, the kids in the Coachella Valley, it's, uh, it's a great event. Uh, it's, it's nice to see it grow over the years. I've been here for, like I said, my third time. So uh, it's just nice to see a, a charity that, you know, uh, starts out small and is clearly picking up steam. It's really fun. This is a great event. Whenever the Bryan brothers ask if you want to go somewhere, you always say yes because it's always fun and it's always for a good cause. Always a good cause. Yep. What do you think of the weather? Well, right now it's great. Beautiful. <laughs> I mean, when the wind's blowing, it's a little tough, but uh, I hate. What's the strongest part of your game? <sighs> Probably running. <laughs> <laughs> I run good. Yeah. <laughs> Who do you think is the, the strongest player out here today? Who have you liked? Oh, I'm in love with Verdasco. Excuse me. <laughs> and I just met him a little while ago. I just texted my daughter. <laughs> Boy, these people are having so much fun out here. Some of the tennis is just great to watch, especially when you've got professional tennis players playing against children. The crowd just goes wild when the kids are able to put one over on a really big tennis player. Here we are with Fernando Verdasco. You are Donna Mills' favorite player out here. Why? I think because you're handsome. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> well, I, you know, I really appreciate now that the people uh, likes me here, and uh, for me it's also so special tournament, and I always, you know, so happy to be here playing. So. Okay. Well, we're gonna watch some more of Fernando. Okay. Fernando. Verdasco. Verdasco. <laughs> you don't, you don't, you don't I have it. love it, it's Fernando out. Verdasco. I'm glad you come and support this wonderful, wonderful cause. I know. Variety Club of the Desert benefiting various children's charities. Um, why is it important that celebrities come out and do this kind of thing? It's, it's a way to make people more aware of issues that you want them to be aware of. And um, it's, it's, it's so important to do things that obviously help. And this is just such a, I mean, for me, it's a tiny little thing I can do. All these charity events are so great, though. I mean, they all, they're all, are all done for a good cause, and the pros come out and support it. And we have the celebrities that were as well. Today, I played with Gavin Rossdale. So a little kind of like yeah. bubbly, you know, adrenaline, you know. Yeah. I mean, this is a great event. I mean, the tennis was great today. Uh, the MC was fantastic. It was a really just enjoyable afternoon. You're quite the tennis player. I do love tennis. Uh, I'm not quite the tennis player. I'm not quite as good as your daughter. <laughs> She's fantastic. And you're also quite a good tennis player. Yes, I'm, I've been playing for, for years. Actually, I went to Pepperdine, played for Pepperdine. Um, so I've been playing for, for years since I was a little kid. I did play tennis in two weeks' notice a few years back. So uh, that was fun. I'm, I'm not a natural-born tennis player. I love playing. I play with my dad, and we have a great time. We are here with Tony Graham, a tennis instructor, a coach. I hear you're extraordinary. Well, coaching's different than playing. I played when I was younger, and coaching is a lot more uh, fun because you get to travel, and you don't have to win yourself. But I live in Beverly Hills, 
And one of my uh, accolades right now is I am the tennis pro at the Playboy Mansion. What's that like? Uh, it's interesting. Um, you know, the, the, the girls come out with five-inch heels, and so we're... And they, and they play tennis? Well... In their heels? To a degree. I mean, if you want to call it tennis, I mean, it's like, we, we have fun. It's hit and giggle. He'll be fine no matter what he does because he's left-handed. And as we were, <laughs> as everyone knows, left-handed people are very talented, very yes. smart. I didn't realize that they tend to be more athletic. I, I was told, I don't know if this is true or not, but I was told something about being left-handed sort of promotes athleticism in a, in a weird way. Like uh, if you're a bowler, you have a natural curve. It, you, you access a different part of your brain, supposedly. I don't know if it's true at all. Don't quote me on it, but that's what I heard. Well, that's about going to do it for us. We hope you had a good time here at the Desert Smash, benefiting the Variety Club of the Desert. This is Joni Ravenna, and I'll see you on the next Hello Paradise.